paints. 1. Enamel paints. Enamels consist of bases like zinc oxide extra ground in varnish. If desired coloring pigments may be added. They dry quickly and furnish a hard glossy surface. Enamel can be used for internal as well as external works and are generally recommended for application on woodwork. Theses are acid resistant, not affected by alkalis, gases and are waterproof. 2. Distemper paints. Distemper is made with base as white chalk and thinner as water. Some coloring pigments and glue are added. They are available in powder and paste forms and are substantially cheaper than paints. They are most suitable for plastered surfaces as well as whitewashed surfaces of interior walls. Oil-bound washable distemper, washable oil-free distemper, and non-washable distemper or emulsion paints are some of the types of distemper. In the oil-bound distemper, the drying oil is rendered mixable with water. While using they are thinned by adding water. On drying, the oil content in distemper hardens and yields a comparatively durable coating. 3. White wash and color wash. Fresh lime slaked with water is mixed thoroughly with water in a tub and then screened through a fine, clean cloth. Thereafter glue, dissolved in water, is added to it. The surface is cleaned and the white wash is applied with jute brushes. A white wash when mixed with coloring pigments such as yellow earth is called color wash. They are generally recommended for low and medium class houses, ceilings are white washed and walls are generally color washed. 4. Varnish. Varnish is a nearly homogeneous solution of resin in oil, alcohol or turpentine. The type of solvent depends upon the type of resin used. Oil varnishes is linseed oil and takes about 24 hours to dry. Hard resins such as amber and kapal are dissolved in linseed oil. Spa varnish derives its name from its use on spas and other parts of ships. It gives sticky effect in warm weather and is not used indoors. Flat varnish materials such as wax, metallic soap or finely divided silica when added to varnish produce a dull appearance on drying and are known as flat varnish. Varnishes Sprit varnish is resins of soft variety such as lac or shellac dissolved in spirit. The examples are French Polish, lacquer and shellac varnish. It dries very quickly. These are not durable and are easily affected by weathering action. Asphalt varnish is made by dissolving melted hard asphalt in linseed oil with a thinner such as turpentine or petroleum spirit. It is used over shop fabricated steel works. Water varnish is shellac dissolved in hot water to which enough quantity of either ammonia, borax, soda or potash is added. These are used for varnishing maps and pictures. 5. French Polish It is a type of spirit varnish, prepared by dissolving resin in methylated spirit at room temperature for use on hardwood substances to hide the grain defects. The surface is made smooth by rubbing. A filler mixed with desired color is prepared to the consistency of a paste applied to the cracks, pause etc. The surface is rubbed after drying and dusted off. Two coats of polish are then applied. The filler material is prepared by mixing 2 kg of whiting in 1.5 liters of methylated spirit or by mixing plaster of Paris, red ochre and linseed oil. 6. Wax Polish it consists of beeswax dissolved in turpentine and is used for highlighting the grain over wooden surfaces. The polish is rubbed over the surface with rag until a bright appearance is obtained. Generally two coats are applied. It may also be used over marble with one part of fuzz dissolved in four parts of hot turpentine or by mixing wax, linseed oil, turpentine oil and varnish in the ratio to 1.5-105 by weight. 7. Aluminium paints. Consist of aluminium powder as base held in suspension by varnish. They are highly heat reflective and resistant to acid fumes. Aluminium paints are used for painting metal roofs, silos, machinery, poles, towers and storage tanks. It provides a very attractive appearance to the surface and the painted surface is visible even in darkness. Aluminium paints have high dispersive property over 200 square meters, liter. 8. Anti-corrosive panets. 
Linseed seed oil is used as vehicle with dry red lead, sublimed blue lead, zinc oxide and iron oxide and zinc chromate as pigments. They are used for preservation of structural steel work against acid fumes and adverse weather conditions. The anther corrosive paints impede or obstruct the corrosion by reducing the direct access of air and water to the metal. These paints should have quick drying and hardening properties. 9. Asbestos Paints The main constituent is fibrous asbestos. These are used for stopping leakage in metal roofs, painting of spouts, gutters, etc. Sometimes on the outer surface of basement wall to prevent dampness. Abscisthos paint is also called fireproof paint. 10. Bituminous paints. They are made of asphalt bitumen dissolved in mineral spirit or nephtha. They are black in color, but suitable coloring pigments may be added for desired color. They are alkali resistant and are used to paint exterior brickwork, concrete and plastered surfaces and to reduce the moisture permeability. Bituminous paints are also used over ironworks underwater. When exposed to sunlight they deteriorate very fast. 11. Bronze Paints Generally a pigment such as aluminium or copper powder is used with a vehicle like nitrocellulose lacquer. They are highly reflective and is applied over radiators. 12. Cellulose paints. They are made by celluloid sheets, amyl acetate substitute or nitrocotton dissolved in petroleum. Also known as lacquers, they are colloidal dispersion of cellulose derivative, resin and plasticizers in solvent and dilutants. Castor oil is also added to improve adhesion, toughness and smoothness of the paint film. A cellulose paint hardens by evaporation of the thinning agent whereas an ordinary paint hardness by oxidation. Being very costly their use is restricted to painting cars, ships and airplanes. The trade names are spray paint, Duco etc. Cellulose paints are not affected by adverse weather conditions. 13. Casein paints. Casein, a protein substance extracted from milk, curd, is mixed with a base like whiting and lithophone. They are available in powder or paste form. They are used over new plaster surface, walls and ceilings. A drying varnish is added when these are used over exterior surfaces of buildings. Casein paints can be tinted in any color. 14. Cement Based Paints White or colored Portland cement with OPC minimum 65% forms the base. They are thinned with water during application. Proper curing is necessary for strength and durability. Cement paints are durable, strong and display better waterproofing qualities and are used on exterior surfaces of buildings. Cement paints are durable, strong and display better waterproofing qualities and are used on exterior surfaces of buildings. 15. Rubber-based paints. Rubber treated with chlorine gas is dissolved in solvent and desired pigment is added. These paints are resistant to acid, alkalis and dampness. Rubber-based paints are used over concrete and cement plastered surfaces. 16. Plastic emulsion paints. They are essentially a dispersion of rubber-like resin polyesterin and polyvinyl acetate in water and are prepared by grinding suitable pigments titanium dioxide in an emulsion of water vehicle and film forming dryer e.g. Co and MN. Sometimes oil is used as vehicle. 17. Plazathic paints. They have plastics as base with water as thinner. They have high covering capacity and give a neat, decorative and pleasing appearance to the surface. Owing to their high cost the plastic paints are mainly used for interiors of auditoriums, showrooms, modern houses and offices. A typical composition of 1 liter of plastic emulsion paint is 0.20 kg of binder, 0.50 kg of pigment, 0.10 kg of other solids and 0.60 kg of water. Thank you.